BEX is vexing the flesh and I'm back with another reaction video. Today we got Felix in Paris for the Louis Vuitton fashion show. And let's just say bro looked like a prince out there. And it was also interesting to see a little bit more about his personality and how he got acquainted with Louis Vuitton. We got Felix Louis Vuitton show day. Paris. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I've never been on like a fun tour bus. It's a huge first. Interesting. Did he enjoy it? Paris just keeps my imagination very awake. I just love everything here right now. In this Bro, did he get the whole bus to himself? <laughs> It's beautiful, honestly. I bet, bro. That bag I always almost... love going outside, taking in the sunlight, and just seeing people walk by and just imagining what their lives would be like. Nah, that's fire. If you never do that, I don't even know if you're human or not. Bro, I every time I go to work, I'm looking around like, dang, every single person got their own life they got their own problems own struggles they overthink probably just like i overthink it's crazy to think that everybody in their own world you know what i'm saying everybody in their own universe they only see from their perspective you know paris is the one and also the most energizing places that i've been so far so okay. right now we're going to see the eiffel tower Oh! Woo! <laughs> Facts, bro. <laughs> bro, this scene is beautiful. Unbelievable. Paris is very famous for its artwork. But I feel like just seeing Paris is just art itself. Because nah, facts. I feel like Kenjin would really like this. I would love to see like a segment of him like on one of these buses or maybe it's a little bit too rough. Maybe on one of these bridges unbothered of him just painting the scene because he's a really gifted artist. But this is probably once in a lifetime. So, so cool. I do want to travel. I want to vlog. I want to do like meet and greets if I get big enough. Like I want to do stuff like that. Like I feel like that's really living. Very life. famous for its artwork. But I feel like just seeing Paris is just art itself because seeing the building, the people, I feel like itself is a picture. It's like a drawing, a painting of a what picture. this country really has to offer. I enjoy a lot of stuff that <laughs> include very artistic moments. With my personal experience, I'm very able to turn those emotions into lyrics. And in a sense, I'm just very glad that a lot of fans can understand and no also effects. sympathize with me. Yeah, I feel that it's my job to be there for our fans. Nah, facts. You do a great they job too, bro. They react straight away. They respond straight away. Whether it's I message them or I share my sense of music and I talk about They understand so well. They give me their attention. I feel like I'm the luckiest person on earth. Because nah, bro. The crazy thing is, is exactly how he feeling. That's how I feel about my YouTube channel. Like, I feel like I'm blessed to be in a position to be myself and have people care about me, especially because a lot of the times I feel alone. A lot of the times I feel like I don't have nobody who understand the way I talk or how deeply I talk about things, how passionately I talk about things. I feel like people talk so surface level. And, you know, I feel like I have a good balance of being fun, but a lot of people don't gel well with me, or I guess I don't gel well with other people and people kind of get boring or mundane to me, you know? And I feel like it's cool that he got that same experience where it's like, dang, I feel blessed to be able to just be me and have people understand me for who I am, you know? It's a blessing. Because a lot of fans truly understand what I have to say. Yeah. Oh, bro, how did he? I find how, a did, lot of how did they get so many of them? I find a lot of inspiration from so many things, whether it's from my members, my fans, 
just listening to their feelings. There are so many things, whether it's just eating bread and butter together. You know, for example, <laughs> I get inspired no by the effects. taste. Sorry. I'll try again. I was like, Dang. no. Uh, the fact that <laughs> he was I, in his A. I'm not gonna lie, he was in his mode. <laughs> and then he just got interrupted the audio, yeah. bro. I'll try again. I was like, no. Oh, okay. The fact that I travel a lot as well to many places. For example, just here in Paris. Even this moment is very inspiring as well. I can't wait to pour my emotions into lyrics and into new music. Uh, hey, we can't wait either, bro. Get right? When I was five years old, I yeah. was performing in front of many people with other kids on stage dressed up as a cheetah. That was when I realized <laughs> this is something that I want to pursue later in the future. That was something very special and important to me. And I'm just very glad that, you know, that's what made me who I am to now. That's fire. This is a beautiful video, bro. Nicely put together by Louis Vuitton. My look today. So I am wearing oh, this that white man. Oh, the drip. <laughs> bro, that man is drippy. Hold up. That man looks look majestic. Today. What do we got right here? Nah, this is a nice fit. The white coat, gold, gold chain, black silhouette. Nice handbag. So I am wearing this white outer, this nice jacket. And also okay. I'm wearing this leather pants. So in a sense, nice touch. it also fits my look. Right now the accessories I'm wearing is the gold Louis Vuitton um, jewelry. And it's a nice color gold too. Nice Louis V accent piece right there. And it don't go all the way around the neck. It matched the shirt. I like the boots. I the am rings. so nervous. <laughs> 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 oh, I mean, definitely I'm nervous, but at the same time, I'm just excited. so excited, you know? Yeah. I I'm know now exactly an ambassador for Louis Vuitton, so to feel more pressure, but at the same time, feel more confident. I can't yeah. wait. The first time I met Nicola, I thought, wow, I've never met, I've never seen someone with so much character, so charming. I was just very blown away about his aura. <laughs> Bro, I ain't gonna lie, if I'm in the crowd, give us the deep voice! <laughs> I'm like, hey. <laughs> hey. <laughs> when I was Something. doing the fitting with this team, they said like, oh, now you're part of the Nicola family. So I'm like, really? Like, me? I felt so honored. <laughs> I know. And right? even for the fitting, everyone there, they were saying like, oh, you look like a prince. He so do. just hearing that kind of, um, compliment it kind of did boost my confidence and royalty every time i wear um louis vuitton and nicolas clothing but i feel brighter i feel cooler i feel much more <laughs> stronger so thanks to him i feel old and confident like a much i also feel like because like he have a somewhat of a relationship with him he also kind of like feeding off of his aura he know that his aura is really really good so he know when he make the clothing that the aura of the clothing is going to be elevated so in a sense he walk around with that elevated type of aura as well much better person of myself and when the show started it came out so bright that the first piece that i saw was very intriguing it was very innovative what stood out to me the most was the bags that came out and the bags it was do the to be nice go one for bags that were very intriguing this collection is very genuine and also just very innovative this is definitely a new legendary piece that he's prepared it's a hit for sure i like the room too the atmosphere New look? The pony? Nice. I'm very happy and I'm very honored to be a part of this story. To start a new chapter with Nicola and Louis Vuitton on the same page. That's the start of a new journey. Bro, his voice is perfect for voiceovers, bro. Oh my God, they gonna... 
They gonna end it like that? Oh my goodness. He could have at least gave us a little something, something. <laughs> Bro, let me know how you feel about uh Stray Kids Felix being a new ambassador for Louis Vuitton. Um, I wish I could afford some Louis Vuitton because that stuff actually looks really, really good. He make it look really, really nice. And I would love to, you know, be able to put that stuff on and look like a, a little print. I would love to be able to put that stuff on and look like a prince as well. But sadly, for now, I'm going to have to look like a little peasant boy. That's what <laughs> for now, I'm going to have to look like a little peasant boy. Um, Let me know what you think down in the comment section and hit that like button for more content like this. Without further ado, I'm out. Peace and love always.